Hello beautiful people, welcome to Gomez Kakuracha's channel. This is a video of a short visit to one of my favorite cities, San Francisco, California. And this is San Francisco. Down from the traffic. It's our last day, so I thought I'd take some videos. Maybe go to some touristy spots later. We're in San Francisco and our first stop for the day is Twin Peaks. We are Twin Peaks right now. It's called Twin Peaks because there's, there's these two hills that are close to each other right in the middle of the city. You can see downtown San Francisco here. It's a little overcast, but it's actually not bad for this time of the year in the city when it can be very foggy and windy. It's not that bad right now. You can see Market Street, that uh, straight on the diagonal of you know, Main Street that runs through the city. And there's, of course, the bay. Um, try and see if we can find. Of the trash and the Golden Gate Bridge later. Here's another view of the downtown area, and from this vantage point, you can actually see clearly. Where is it? Alcatraz in this light blue, yellow right here. And there's Angel Island, uh, Bigger Island, um, right next to it, right in the middle of San Francisco Bay. Here's hopefully a better view of the Golden Gate Bridge. I'll zoom in a little bit. I'm seeing the clouds, where's the bridge? The bridge should be right there. It's a little hazy, so it's kind of hard to see. But there it is. It's not really golden in color. Uh, as I thought when I was young, when I first moved here. Uh, it's gold, golden because I think it's it's the main uh, entrance to at that time California uh, was having the gold rush. <laughs> Most of the people here probably on the tour bus, which is probably part of the cruise. The reason why it's called the Twin Peaks, these are the Twin Peaks that constitute the Peaks. Stop. I think it's just about to open. We're not going to stay very long because I'm sort of parked legally. There seems to be a uh, Ferris wheel here right in the middle of this uh, park area here. We're inside a Golden Gate Park and it's a huge park but I thought I'd just uh, take you here. Uh, there's the Dion Museum. That's another iconic uh, building. I used to get there, go there when I live here. They would have three days for San Francisco residents. That area there is called the Music Concourse because there's uh, they frequently have free concerts there, especially during the summer and on weekends. Here's a closer view of the De Young Museum. There's the Ferris wheel. That I've never seen before, just here for the summer. 
and on the other side is of course the California Academy of Sciences and there's the music concert. We're here at Salt Lake, one of my favorite places to visit here in the Golden Gate Park when I used to live in San Francisco. Uh, we used to take our dog Pikachu here every weekend. It could be very busy because it's very dog friendly here and there's many different places to explore, especially for a dog. Uh, we usually walk around this lake about a mile and a half or two miles. Uh, and that it also takes me to different parts of the Golden Gate Park. Here's a place that's popular among tourists. This is where you can rent uh, um, paddle boats or row boats for I think 30 minutes or so or longer. I only did it once. It's a lot of fun. This is uh, another part of Stow Lake. And back there, I don't know if you can see, is what's called the uh, Chinese Pavilion. Uh, you can access that through the inner circle around the strawberry hill and we like going there bringing our a picnic and having lunch there we're still at Snow Lake in another park um, and I'm not sure you can see it but there's what's called uh, the strawberry strawberry hill waterfalls right there. It's actually an artificial waterfall. Oh here's a better view of the waterfalls. And not too far from it is the uh, Chinese pavilion right there. So it's a good place to stop and snack. Of course Stow Lake is just a small part of the park. The park is huge. Although well, San Francisco is a small city, right in the middle of it, I am not sure how big, but this Golden Gate Park is really extending from one end to the other end of the city. Another quick pit stop, this time uh, the uh, St. Mary's Cathedral, still in San Francisco. Another very iconic and uh, very famous landmark here. This is the San Francisco City Hall. This whole area here is called the Nat United Nations Plaza. And that's the uh, uh, main public library, San Francisco Public Library, City Public Library. There's the city hall again. Uh, another building around. Here's another view of the city hall while we're stuck in traffic in a red light. Here's the house where I used to live for about 25 years until less than five years ago. The palm trees in the front have grown, but especially these strawberry trees that we planted. When were these planted? When did we plant the strawberry trees? 2007, so it's about 16 years there, two months now. We're here to visit an old neighbor here, Herb. For a short dessert before we go back to Southern California.